It seems like every time I make a flex video of some sort, whether that be how I got my RGB, or how I got my frostbite, or how I got my first antimatter, or how I got my first disintegrator, or how I got two of every unobtainable, or how I got three of every unobtainable, there are always people in the comments asking, Cal, where's your vertigo? Cal, you don't have vertigo. Cal, it's great that you have all this stuff, but you don't have a vertigo. And today I can finally say that has changed and it only took the most expensive trade in Krunker history. Hey, what's going on guys? It's Caleb or Cal here and today in this video, I'm gonna be going over the journey of my hunt for the vertigo and how I finally got the rarest unobtainable skin in Krunker.io. Before I get into the video though, make sure to drop a like and a comment. I normally don't put a like goal, but if we could reach a thousand likes for the most expensive trade in Krunker history, that would be super dope. Also subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and if you guys are gonna buy care in the Krunker shop, make sure to use code Cal to directly support me. Using my code is one of the best ways to support me and I greatly appreciate anybody who uses it. But with all that aside, let's get right into the video. So obviously I got the vertigo today, but the journey did not start today. I started officially looking into how I could get a vertigo on June 12th of 2020. So it was a little bit over a month ago. I messaged some people asking what it would take for me to get their vertigo. And obviously there are only six owners. I messaged Absent and he told me that he was just legit not trading the skin. I messaged Jaith. He said he's not trading it either. And finally I messaged Vortex and Vortex actually kind of gave me hope instead of immediately shutting down my proposal he basically said that he would take a look at my offer and I don't really remember what I offered him I think it was around three mil at the time but unfortunately Vortex shut me down he said that he's had better offers before which honestly I was kind of surprised by because Strems at the time got his vertigo for around two mil so I thought my offer was pretty good but I guess it wasn't and I knew that no one else who had the vertigo like Cerno, Frosty or Strems would trade it so I basically stopped my search for the vertigo there and then a couple of weeks later the topic of vertigo was brought up again on my stream and at this point I had around two or three of every unobtainable in the game so I could definitely spare a couple of these unobtainables for a vertigo offer and once again I don't remember exactly what the offer was and I did most of this on stream which I think the VODs are deleted by now but I remember it was more than my first offer it might have been around four to five mil but once again Vortex said that that wasn't quite enough it was a better offer than my first one for sure but he still said that he wouldn't trade it for that much and so many times throughout this journey I thought that I was just never gonna get this skin. I mean, people who had it were either not trading it or just charging way too much. And I thought that I was never gonna get it all the way until Strems actually said that he would consider trading it if the offer was good enough. And if you guys do not know, Strems paid around 2.5 mil for his vertigo at the time. He got it from Mitch. And in today's prices, it would be around five to six mil. But at the time, it was around two, 2.5 mil. And I never thought he would trade it because he actually worked really hard to get it. But apparently, I thought wrong because he said that if the price was right, that I could get it. So I did also throw him the same four to five mil offer that I sent to Vortex. Unfortunately, Strem not thinks this is enough, so he declined. But then a couple of days later, I got a message from Strems that another collector was actually trying to get Strems' vertigo. And this guy goes by the name of Essa. His IGN is Exa BW. He's also an extremely rich collector, and the way he gets his wealth is actually just by buying a bunch of KR, because this guy is actually rich in real life, so he has the money to spend if he wanted to. And he's dropped so much where he has basically every unobtainable in the game. And he shot this offer to Strems plus 600,000 KR. And at the time I said, holy shit, that's so much. I don't think I'm gonna one up it. If you wanna take it, then it's all his. And Strems was streaming at the time when he got this offer and he was thinking about it on stream for a while. And Essa actually bumped his offer from this to even more. Essa offered even more KR. So I was thinking whenever I was watching this that I was definitely not gonna get Vertigo. I mean, this was too much to ever offer. But after thinking for a while, Strems actually declined Essa, saying that it was Vertigo, the rarest item in the game, and that much would not be enough to trade for it. And honestly, that move put me over even more. Strems declined basically what was 5 mil in today's prices and I really thought that there was no way I was going to offer even more than that. So at this point I'd definitely given up on the vertigo. All the way until yesterday whenever Essa actually brought up another offer and this was the offer. It was around 7 mil in rare items and it was actually kind of similar to the offer I had sent before. They just added on a bunch more stuff and even though I said that I was never going to one up the last offer that Essa sent, this time I was actually thinking about doing it because I I had actually obtained a lot more unobtainables since the last time I had offered for Vertigo, so I was willing to give up more unobtainables to get it. And I told Strems that I would do all of this plus two of the bits items. So I basically went up to Essa by over 600k. And the thing is that Essa actually did not have the skins at the time. He still needed to buy some of them. So Strems 
asked if I said yes to your offer, would you send it right now? And to be completely honest, I was basically stealing Essa's offer here and Essa really wanted the Vertigo as well. So instead of just taking it immediately, I decided to message Vortex again, the original person I was trying to trade Vertigo with, to see if he would actually do this trade as a mirror to Strems. So basically what I was trying to work out is two Vertigo trades in the same day, basically a mirror trade, where me and Essa would pay the same amount and both get Vertigo. And that would have been pretty cool if it worked, but unfortunately, I sent this offer to Vortex and after a bit of discussion, he decided that it was not quite enough either. So Vortex basically became off the table for this deal. And I said, screw it. I mean, I'm sorry, Essa, for basically stealing your vertigo, but I really want this vertigo as well. So I shot the offer to Strems, and this is on stream. And the offer went through several stages. I had to keep on one-upping it because Strems was super hesitant to trade it. And originally, I offered to add a whole Yogfoss to the offer, which would have made it around 8 mil, but apparently that still wasn't enough. So I one up the offer again, and instead of a Yogfoss, I added a Disintegrator to the deal, but that still wasn't enough. And Strems decided that he wanted another RGB because RGB is probably the second most expensive unobtainable skin. So instead of the second disintegrator, the Venta and the Spectralon, I offered to throw in a second RGB in that deal. And at this point, the offer was around 9 mil, honestly inching towards 10 million. But Strems was still super hesitant and he was thinking hard. He was literally staring at his trade screen for over an hour thinking about my trade. I would post some clips here, but unfortunately due to some complications, his VOD was actually deleted. And the only clip I have is the one of him actually accepting the deal. But anyways, after a lot of thinking, Strems hit me with his final counter offer, and that was if I added a third RGB to the trade and take away the rainbow AK and take away the rainbow sniper. He said that he would accept instantly, no questions asked. And oh my god, was I hesitant as hell as well because this was over 10 million, almost 11 million in skins. And it also required me trading away all but one of my RGBs. So if I did this trade, then I would have to sacrifice all my duplicate RGBs. Honestly, I thought that I already made it this far and if I didn't pay this much, then I would probably never get the vertigo. So I said, screw it. I sent him the offer and the rest is history. But yeah guys, that was the most expensive trade in the history of Krunker. Now that the trade has gone through and it's been a couple hours, I can honestly say that I don't regret it at all. I thought I regret it a little bit, but honestly, I'm happy that I did the trade because I now have the most expensive unobtainable skin and basically the rarest skin in the game, as well as all the unobtainables in the game. And I also made Krunker history with the most expensive deal ever done. I asked Strems also, and he says he doesn't regret it either. Strems is now filthy freaking rich. And if you're wondering, how this trade impacted my inventory, my inventory estimated value is still 11.3 million. And before this trade, it was around 13 million. So I took a 2 million dent, but I'm still filthy rich as well. And I'm still probably the richest player in the game. So I'm mad chilling and I now have vertigo. You guys can't make fun of me for not having this anymore. That is gonna be it for the video guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, definitely make sure to leave a like and a comment. I normally don't put a like goal, but if we could reach a thousand likes for the most expensive trade in Krunker history, History, that would be super dope. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And as always, if you guys are gonna buy care or any cracker shop, make sure to use code CAL to directly support me. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Caleb or Cal, and I will see you guys next time. <laughs>